think that's all of them. You got the guys upstairs? Yeah, you can have your hotel back. A hotel? Good. Now we just have to kick these punks out of Manhattan. My brother Paul's heading up the operation. The NSF won't have New York for long. There were a couple of NSF on the second floor. I took care of the situation. What about the hostages? Doing fine. You guys can relax. Guess we didn't need that specialist after all. Ambrosia from a drug dealer? We're talking about your wife, the Grey Death. I don't know. If I gave it to her, and it was cut... Jojo's good for it. People know him. He'd be hanging from a streetlight if he was selling bad vaccine. Hey, Shay, Kit Cod. Here's a little vodka this time. Coming up. Guess I have to do something. Yes? Just curious. I thought I heard you say Ambrosia. My wife has the plague. He already lost his daughter. Sorry to hear that. So do I trust some street punk called Jojo to get me pharmaceuticals? Trust him with my wife's life? I thought Ambrosia was an urban legend. Jojo probably just wants to sound like a player. I shouldn't get my hopes up. I don't know what to say. You just have to do what you think is right. Can I ask a question? Go right ahead. I'm looking around for a power generator. Possibly hidden, large enough to power a building. You in real estate? I just need to find it. Oh, 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 of course. You know, I tied in power at a place a few blocks south. A warehouse. Strangest thing. They wanted to conceal these gas-driven generators on the second floor. Didn't give a hoot if their own people got asphyxiated. How do I get over there? No way through the blockades now. We went over some rooftops to get there. There was a lift. The code was 3316, I think. Thanks for the tip. What can I get you? You work here. You must know the area. Heard of an old warehouse with an illegal power generator? Not exactly. But if you're looking for a warehouse, you should probably start in the warehouse district. Where's that? A few blocks south. Not a bad walk, but the riot police have blocked the roads because of the NSF. I'd like to check it out. Well, you may be out of luck. Even though one of the old warehouses faces onto the park, I don't know how you get inside. Sounds like a good place to start. Something to drink? Everything in the bar, snacks too, just ten credits. That's some heavy augmentation. Yeah. Ask you Natco, what's it to you? I'm in the business. Well, I was in an early program, okay? I can still polish a glass. Good luck with your business. Mind if I ask you a few questions? Hey, you look like the vigilante type. What if I said I knew where you could load up on military hardware? You mean that guy smuggler across the street? Already know him, huh? Too bad. Hey, how about I tell you about something you can't hear from anybody else? What's that? 
Area 51. You heard of it, right? Actually, I'd rather hear whether you know anything about a warehouse with an illicit generator. I worked out there. Most people think they got aliens from another planet, but I didn't see any flying saucers. You want to hear about it? I'll tell you. For the price of a beer. I'm gonna do it. I'm glad. I hope she does better. What do you have for me? You can have this beer. That one's warm. Give me something from the bartender. What'll it be? A beer, please. There you go. What do you have for me? You can have this beer. I appreciate it. Yep, I know for a fact it's not just for government research. I've seen all kinds of executives coming and going. I'm sure plenty of bureaucrats fly out there. Billionaires. Big executives. I think the whole place has been taken over by a private corporation. Not likely. Something's going on underground. I'm a pilot, which means I didn't get any access to the main complex. But a lot of rock comes out of there. It's some kind of mine. But what I don't understand is why they're always laying more fiber optic cables. A pilot? What do you fly? Copters. You know what I think? I think that's where the UN moved Echelon 4 back when they promised they were going to stop spying on people. Surveillance is a very distributed technology. To centralize it in one large facility would be very unusual, even for the UN. I bet they did it. They want to centralize everything. Every computer on the planet. Know anything that's worth the price of a beer? Ah, this old bird's had enough. Well, I'm about to go on duty. What kind of chopper pilot starts work at midnight? You're with UNATCO, right? Why do you ask? I'm the one that flies your brother Paul to Hong Kong. He told me to watch out for you. I didn't know UNATCO hired pilots. The black choppers are run by the NSA to support various classified operations. The Pentagon uses them, the CIA. They hired me because I don't ask any questions. What was Paul's assignment in Hong Kong? Like I said, I know how to keep a secret. Even between brothers. So he's holding something back. The reason UNACO transferred him back to the States. Listen to your brother, JC. Respect his experience. Let's leave it at that. I talked to your father. He asked me to invite you back home. No strings attached. How sweet. You could at least let your father know you're all right. He knows where I am. You mad at him or something? No, but I don't want him running my life like he runs that cheap hotel. He doesn't do such a bad job. He never got nowhere because he never took chances. That ain't me. I'm gonna do things my way. I think you should be more grateful for what he's done. Let's leave it at that. You the guy that helped Sandra? I think your friend is gonna be all right. What about Johnny? I gave him a good scare. Where's he at? I don't know, but if he gives you any more trouble, just tell me. I hope he doesn't think I ratted him out. What can you tell me about his boss, Jojo? Oh, Jojo, he's nothing, man. We used to go out. His body mods? Cosmetic. Scars? <laughs> I saw him cut his face one time just so he'd look mean. Maybe I'll straighten him out as well. Well, if you ever want to get into the warehouse where he hides out, I know the code. It's 3316. Thanks. You've been very helpful. Joe Green, Midnight Sun, glad to know you. What can you tell me about what's going on out there? Sorry, regulations prevent me from talking to the press. Regulations, eh? So you are part of the crackdown. Like I said, I have nothing to say. Too stylish for the National Guard? Too athletic for NYPD? You must be from UNATCO. I really can't be bothered right now. How about I ask you a few questions? Splendid! I certainly would like to know what an international anti-terrorist organization expects to find in a dive like this. On second thought, I don't need your help. Then let me ask you a question. What do you think about the summary executions happening on the very streets of New York? I'd call it civil unrest. Let me be more pointed. How does it feel to be ordered to murder civilians just because they support the fastest growing political movement in this nation's history? In a democracy, armed rebellion is criminal, not political. 
Rebellion, as the Declaration of Independence tells us, is not only our right, but our duty when we have suffered a long train of abuses and usurpations. Huh? <laughs> 